everyone, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. My name is Carl. Today's video is called Pickups and Mail. Been away for the Easter holidays, so we got five titles to get through today. Also, while I was away, I had a delivery sent through from HMV. There's two titles inside here. Gonna be opening these two titles up, taking a look inside, seeing what we're actually getting. I've also got a filming location quickly to show you as well. If you popped over to the channel for the very first time, thank you so much for taking the time. Please consider subscribing and hitting that notification bell if you can, thank you. So we've just had the Easter holidays. Hope you all had a very good Easter. We decided to spend a few days away at Stacy's mum's who lives in Ramsgate, which of course isn't too far from a YouTuber called Big Paulie. And we were planning to meet up, but unfortunately Big Paulie was working. Not only that, the truck situation around Dover is a trucking nightmare, sorry. But it is, I saw it back on the M2 and it just wouldn't have been practical for him. But the good news is we are planning to meet up in the summertime. So what did we do on our trip away to Ramsgate? Did I pick anything up? Day one, I didn't pick anything up on day one. We decided to go for a lovely walk at a place called Eastcliff. The sun was shining so much. It was so nice. It was lovely to catch up with Stacy's mum, grab the kids an ice cream, which they really did enjoy. Take the sea view in and the sea air in. It was absolutely a brilliant day. When I got back to Stacy's mum's, Stacy's mum said to me, Carl, you might be interested, they're filming a brand new Sam Mendes movie in Margate. Day two, we decided to take a trip to Margate. It's not that far from Ramsgate. It's about two, three miles up the road and they are filming the brand new Sam Mendes Hollywood blockbuster movie called Empire of Light which is going to star Olivia Coleman and Colin Firth. The famous Dreamland is tucked just behind there. And at first I thought this was the cue to get into Dreamland, but Dreamland was actually closed. And we did hear someone say that apparently this is the cue for the extras line for Empire of Light. I can't tell you how tempted I was to get on the end of that line. I don't know once I go through those doors whether Sam Mendes would be sitting in front of me, probably not, but I was so tempted. And I think filming is just about to start on that one. It may have started already, but I look forward to watching that movie when that finally gets released. It was a great day in Margate. Got some chips, had them on the stairs, which the boys enjoyed. And I did get to film my intro for the Top Gun Maverick film that gets released at the end of May. So I can't wait to put that one out there. I did pop into Margate Town. It's not a very big town. There is a CEX there, very small CEX. And unfortunately, I didn't pick anything up in that CEX. So we pop back to West Cross, look around West Cross, and I popped in Primarni. Primark is starting to get really good at selling movie t-shirts and movie clothing in general. I picked this one up here. I did notice the other day that Crazy J, aka Jamie Powell, and I think they're the same person, hope they are, has actually got this one. And this is the Batman hoodie. It's got a brilliant picture on the back of the Batman. And if you show you the label there, of the Batman label. So it's official merchandise and they're getting really good at having movie clothing in stock. So well done. Primark. Day three, we decided to take a walk to Ramsgate Harbour and onto the seafront so the boys can play in the sand, grab an ice cream. The weather was still very nice. Just before you get to Ramsgate Harbour, you've got Ramsgate town and it's not a particular big town but there are a few shops to visit there they do have a cex there's a lot of restaurants and cafes there it's basically the other end of west cross where big paulie goes but it is a drive away now this particular cex i do feel that big paulie should visit it's not a particular big cex but every time i pop in there i always manage to pick something up. I picked four titles up in that shop. 
I've left the prices on for this video so you could check out the prices because I don't know whether I've actually got ripped off or not. I didn't go and check the prices on Amazon, that sort of thing. Went ahead, picked them up because I wanted these four titles for the collection. The first title I picked up is Gravity, starring Sandra Bullock and George Clooney. Let's take a look inside. Inside we have a plain black disc and we do have a digital code as well. And that's the movie Gravity for £1.50. The next title I picked up is Bad Neighbours. Let's take a look inside. Inside we do get artwork on the disc and we do get another digital code with that one. And that's the movie Bad Neighbours. That's a bargain at 50 pence. The next title I picked up from CEX was a movie called Triangle, starring Melissa George. It does come with this rather nice slip. I don't think it was a particular good movie. I think they're on a yacht and they get stranded in a storm, so they board an ocean liner, if I can remember rightly. Let's take a look inside. And inside we do get artwork on the disc. And that's the movie Triangle for £2, with a brilliant slip cover. The last title I picked up in Ramsgate CEX, I saw this on holiday, I thought it was a very good movie. Stacey hasn't seen it yet and it is Drag Me To Hell. Inside we do get artwork on the disc and we do get advertising from Lionsgate. And that's the horror movie Drag Me To Hell which was a worthy watch but I'm not too sure if that's overpriced at £3 because it is an older movie. Do let me know in the comments because I didn't check them. Later that day I had a trip to Asda because we were running low on food obviously and they had quite a big Asda there and quite a good selection of movies. I picked this one up, State of Play. Let's take a look inside. Inside we do get artwork on the disc. And that's the movie State of Play. Not a bad price at £2 from Asda. They did many other titles in there for £2. It's really bugging me because I can't really remember too much about this movie. I know it stars Russell Crowe, Ben Affleck, Helen Mirren. So I'm looking forward to giving this one a rewatch. And that's State of Play. Those were all my pickups on our trip away to Ramsgate. A massive thank you to Stacey's mum for having us there, putting up with us. And it was just great fun just to get out of the house and get away, have a nice little mini breakaway. When we arrived home, this arrived. This is a parcel from H&V. There's two titles inside. So let's crack this open and show you the titles I have inside. One of them is a movie from this year that I haven't seen. I wanted to see it, but no one would go to the cinema with me to watch it. Everyone has seen it on YouTube lands. The first movie is this one here. Scream. Let's take a look inside. Inside, it's very disappointing. Just a plain silver disc. Comes with a slip cover that has the same artwork as the inside cover. And that's the 2022 movie, Scream. Really looking forward to finally watching this movie for the very first time. Watched everybody else's YouTube videos on this movie. So I'm looking forward to giving it a go myself. Unfortunately, I had no one to go to the cinema with me. <laughs> anyway, moving on. The last title I picked up from HMV is a 101 Films title. The YouTube channel, Alan Scouser. Highly recommends this movie. In fact, I think he gave it a 10 out of 10 and it is called She Freak. Let's open it up and take a look. So first it comes with a slip cover, which has the same artwork inside. Artwork on the disc. Comes with this little booklet, very thin, roughly around about 10 pages few pictures in there, things to read. Inside cover art, which of course is reversible. 
And that's the movie She Freak from 101 Films. Looking forward to giving this one a watch because I've heard good reviews on this one. Also can't wait to watch this 2022 movie of Scream at last. Those are both my HMV pickups along with my Ramsgate pickups as well. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this pickups and mail video. If you like this video, please do give it a like. Also don't forget to share and subscribe if you can because it really does help the channel out. See you in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.